much for coming here today. I am so excited that we will be opening Severn University's Community Support and Women's Center. Thank you. Thank you. As your campus rep and strong feminist, I wanted to lean in <laughs> and listen up to what ideas you guys have for the space. Now, as young women, we have an obligation to... <coughs> uh, yeah, yeah, if I could just weigh in. Um, yes, please, go ahead. I just really want to commend what you all are doing here, and I hope that you don't let anyone or any man Silence what you've decided here today. Okay, uh, well we haven't started yet, but thank you. Well, whatever so it is you end up deciding, know that I support it. <laughs> I will now announce my speaking rights so as to begin to tip the scales from a millennia of male privilege. Solidarity, sisters. <laughs> All right, um, thank you for that. So, uh, Let's just clarify that this is meant to be a safe space. A place where people can engage and be themselves without fear of discrimination. Um, it's, excuse me? Yeah. I think the term safe space is insensitive and quite frankly, ignorant. Oh, well, you know, did someone tell you about the asbestos because I was told that this would not be a problem unless it rains for three days in a row? I prefer the term safe first space. Safe space is false advertising. Can any of us truly be safe from oppression? And no. It assaults us at every turn, okay? Like, really, look at your shoes. High heels? Shoes fundamentally designed to weaken you and throw you off balance from a predator. Can you say, rape boots? <laughs> I got these on Payless. Well, I think you look empowered. Like Eleanor Roosevelt, but not ugly. <laughs> okay, uh, uh, safer space it is then. Thank you. Uh, thank you for teaching us that. You're welcome. Okay. All right, so, okay, so we know we want this to be a safer space. Yeah. A place where women can get together and discuss the common barriers that we face. You know, why don't we collectively think about a name? Personally, I really love the Empower Her Center. Oh, 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 oh. We should call it the Center to Usurp Normative Tyranny because then the acronym can be CUA. Oh, I, know <laughs> <laughs> I think we got it. Uh, you know, maybe I'll take that one upstairs and workshop it a bit. Uh, you know what? Let's, uh, let's just move forward. How about the overall vibe of this space? I want it to feel grounded and homey. Okay, and so uh, well first things first, that kitten poster that says hang in there <laughs> needs to go. Why? Uh, it's obviously triggering, okay? It says hang in there, and there's a picture of a pussycat dangling all alone. It might as well just say, uh, 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 go kill yourself, you stupid lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> Word. Listen, I brought this from home. My mom gave it to me. When okay, I okay, okay. Um, why don't we have some art that celebrates the beauty of the female form? Yes. Now, I have some tasteful news no. that I would be willing no. to do. I'm sorry, I thought you denounced your speaking rights. Um, I have a question. Yes. Yeah, are we going to get more couches in here? Because I need a place where I can periodically take naps because interfacing with the patriarchy is tiring. <laughs> also, no white touch or make eye contact with my fer pet fer ferret RV Wade because she's also working through trauma. I have some pamphlets if anybody wants any more information. Okay, all right. All right. So I read in the flyer that we're gonna distribute condoms, which yes. is disgusting. Do you know how many dolphins die a year from flushed condoms? I don't know what a condom is. <laughs> That's why I'm a lesbian. Uh, four, okay? That we know of. That's a lot. Okay. Look, I, I, I think that the two of you have something different in mind than what I originally whoa, envisioned whoa, for this space. Whoa, And it's the two of us? Like we're the same? No. Binders full of women much? No, that's not what I said. <laughs> okay, we are not the same. No. First of all, she eats dairy. <laughs> And secondly, she called Susan Miller's commentary on the material conditions of women in textual spaces a 
derivative. What is a derivative? <laughs> if you let her use this face, I will personally feel threatened. I'm feeling threatened right now. I will not feel if safe. If you rage me, I'll fuck you. No, I can't. I don't want to go crazy. 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 doesn't understand intersectional identities, am I right? <laughs> Ugh, <Whoa. no. laughs> really? Even after all that, none of you are gonna sleep with me. No. Oh, this is bullshit! 